Uh, we're a gold exploration company, and we're located in uh, Guyana, in southern Guyana, and, it, and we have our flagship project, the Maruti Gold Project. Uh, some of our recent milestones was the discovery of a new zone, a mineralized zone called the Toucan Ridge Zone, and it's looking very good uh, in terms of uh, the potential to add additional ounces to our property, and we're very excited about that. We already have a resource on our property, and the ability to add a second or a third uh, uh, zone of mineralization uh, puts us in a position to, uh, to grow our asset to a multi-million ounce uh, resource. Uh, Ghana Gold Strike uh, has its flagship project, the Maruti Gold Project in southern Guyana. Uh, we're really excited about this project. It comes with a uh, current resource and it comes with the ability to really expand beyond that resource to a multi-million ounce opportunity. And we're really looking forward to further exploration in, in the months and, and later this year to really open up the property and uh, discover the additional ounces to get into that multi-million ounce uh, zone. Yeah, again, the major growth opportunities are, are, are is very straightforward. We want to explore and open up the property and uh, move the project into a multi-million ounce scenario. One that uh, when you look at a 10-year discounted cash flow, it, it, the numbers look really good and a mid-tier or a major will take interest in this. And in a good gold market, uh, it would be a project that would be prime for uh, a, a, a major company to come in and potentially take off our hands and, and move into a production scenario. Main major challenge right now is the market itself. Uh, it, it's, a, it's a struggling market, it's a, the resource market is difficult, and what we need to keep in mind, or shareholders need to keep in mind, is that uh, the cycle is your friend, the cycle will come around, and when it does come around, it'll, it'll be very, very good for uh, everyone that's involved and positioned at this time. Uh, its cycle will happen, and so we need to have the patience as a company, even as shareholders, to, uh, to, to weather what we're going through now, to move business forward, grow our asset, and just position ourselves for when that cycle comes. A uh, main separation uh, from uh, us and our peers is the fact that we're a standalone company in southern Guyana. And this gives us the opportunity to continue to expand beyond the Maruti project uh, to potentially other areas uh, in the south and uh, have a foothold or a, uh, a pull position or a lead advantage uh, in, uh, in establishing ourselves in the south. Uh, this will have great value uh, when there's a, a mid-tier or a major company looking at uh, partnering with us or, or taking us to the next level. An investment proposition is very simple. We're a $10 million market cap and through additional uh, discovery of ounces on our property and our ability to perhaps uh, become a, a multi-million ounce uh, um, asset, uh, we will definitely move beyond a $10 million market cap uh, uh, and in a good market uh, that could be 10, 20 fold. Uh, basically, a TSXV listing allows us to uh, to raise money, and, and uh, you know, we're junior markets uh, need an ability to go to the market to raise uh, equity financings, and this allows us to then move our asset, uh, grow our assets, and move our our operations forward. It's absolutely essential. It's very difficult to do as a private company, so uh, having a, a public listing is very important to us.